Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare My name is Charu Das. I joined the Krishna Conscious Movement in 1970. I met a devotee uh, as I was coming home from work, <clears throat> uh, downtown Sydney on George Street, Winyard Station. And uh, he told me that love of God was a seed within everyone's heart. The only problem is that most of us don't know the process of water yet. We rise early um, and we have a pre-dawn ceremony called Mangalarti, where we sing the praises of the Lord. We see, uh, among other things, God is like a king, and just in the olden days when a king would be awakened by a bard singing his glories, we present ourselves uh, in the early morning hours. Bible it says, sing the name of the Lord in the heavens, sing them in the earth, sing them when you're happy, sing them when you're sad, sing it with drums and lute and lyre and cymbals. classes every evening on the Bhagavad Gita at 6 o'clock, followed by yoga. Uh, we have a special open house every Sunday at 5 o'clock with chanting and a PowerPoint. Uh, we have a buffet open throughout the week, vegetarian buffet, there's a gift store. There are a lot of animals on the property, llamas, peacocks, parrot. I mean, we also observe the major Indian festivals like Holi, the Festival of Colors in March, Festival of Lights in November, Krishna's birthday in August, Shivaratri in February. We have one festival that's not related to our religion, just for fun. It's kind of a tongue-in-cheek festival, but it's become very popular. It'll be in its 17th year this year, the Lama Fest. <laughs> when you're serving God, there's no retirement. You do it up until the day you drop dead. There was a lady who died recently in Los Angeles at the age of 114, and they asked her just before she expired, to what did you, do you attribute your long life? And she said, the Lord wasn't finished with me. Hare Krishna.